Wolfgang? Who's that? Ah, these young punks don't know anything. Wolfgang is a gang of wolves. Well, you two never read the script. Wolfgang isn't a gang. We are going to join the Wolfgang Violin Studio. <laughs> Hey, Bill, this is your fault. You are supposed to read the script and I'm supposed to do the funny stuff. Okay. the violin. That music you hear can sound like fingernails on a blackboard. But if it was that easy to master the violin, we'd all be violinists. Mastering the violin is a complex skill that requires years of intensive training, discipline and commitment. And if that isn't hard enough, the truly talented violinist must combine emotional depth with technical artistry in his performance. I think a lot of parents have heard of the Mozart effect about how it, uh, kids do better in school and their scores are better. But I think even more above and beyond that, I think just the whole world of music, it's such a, such a wonderful, magical world that I think all kids should be exposed to. And so for me, I think the violin's a wonderful way. It's a very group activity that once you get good at it, once you're better, you can play chamber music with your friends or you can join an orchestra, which is very fun because then you're in a big group of like 80 kids making music together. So I don't ever think it's too late to learn the violin, just if it's for your own passion, for your own love. I can express many different things through music that I can't otherwise in words. I think music is its a wonderful world. Tonight's knockout judge is Min Lee, award-winning violinist and program director at the Wolfgang Violin Studio. She emphasizes having fun while learning the violin. With students as young as four years old, that sounds like a pretty good plan. But what happens when your students are four-year-olds trapped in grown-up bodies? Let's just say that tonight's challenge isn't only for our hosts. Good luck, Min Lee. And so there are four strings. This is the G, 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 D, A, and E. G, D, A, E. Okay. Okay. You're only going to need two strings today, the A and the E. Oh. So those are the only two you need to know. That's okay. it. And that's the bridge. What? And oh, this is the bridge. And I'll be giving you the bow a little later. Okay, I'm just going to swing, swing, and then gently. Gently, no, not right gently. now. I'll, I'll help you with it later. Okay, this up to your shoulder. This is what you're gonna do. That's, that's, that's it. One, two, three. Swing it up. That's it. Done. Very nice. This is the bow. Basically, what you're just gonna do, just gonna shake, 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 shake your hand out, and then dump it onto the bow. Okay. This is a little groove here. Yes. Okay. Your thumb's gonna fit in the groove. These two go around it, and that's it. Okay. Okay. Basically, you just want to hold the bow the way you walk down the street. So if I'm walking down the street like that, shake out my hand, just put the bow just like that. If I take the bow out of my hand... If you were to walk with a bow down the street. So if you... None of this. If you don't walk down the street, uh, that's quite common. Okay. How many strings are there? Made of horse hair, so I'm not quite oh. sure how many. Oh. Okay. That's it. No tension at all. Just like you're bouncing the ball. Bounce, bounce. Thumb there. Fingers in, that's it. Just... Oops, oh, sorry. No. <laughs> These are dangerous things. Diamond, square. Okay, try that on your own. Diamond, square. Diamond, square. Good, nice and light. Diamond, square. Diamond, square. Perfect. Are you ready to play the violin now? I think we are. Okay. <laughs> We're gonna put the violin in now and the bow. Okay. okay. Uh, men, men cannot multitask. I'm sure you know that. Men. But, but you are special. I'm walking with the bow. That's right. I'm walking with the bow. Okay. See me walking down the street okay, with the bow. Oh, let's it up. Sa, 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 sa. Can you see my double chin or do I look okay? Okay. Three on the A. Do it by 
yourself. You try first. Play today is twinkle, twinkle, the little star. star. Okay. So for to do that, you're gonna need three fingers. One, two, and three. So in the violin, it's not. This is your first finger. This is your second. This is your third, and this is your fourth. Okay. Also, just called your thumb. Okay. That's for your first finger. This for your second. Second, and this for your third finger. Three. I, I thought we get to like. Yes, first you gotta learn how to put down your one thinkers. Mm? Emmanuel! Yes, with Emmanuel. Hit it, brother! Check it out one time. Hey. You have a perfect bow hold now. That's perfect. Oh, okay. How does that feel? Not so perfect. Yeah. But it looks great. Okay. <laughs> That's perfect. Mm -hmm. Right on the top. when we start the first line, like, perfect. Okay. And then at the end, I think he gets stressed out and starts going funky. Can you memorize this? If you can, that'd be perfect. Okay. Everything must be perfect. Yes, it has to be perfect. did really well for just having one hour to learn the violin. Thank I've been you. playing Thank since you. I was two and a half and I still don't think it's easy. <laughs> so both well, groups did really, really well. Yeah. Thank you very much. That's a lovely teacher, that's why. Thank you. <laughs> well, anyway, for the new school, what was really impressive is that you memorized it. You didn't have any music and your left hands were all actually pretty nice and you hit all the right notes. Well, for the old school, um, a plus for effort, mm -hmm. and the style, I really like the beginning, how you sewn up together. <laughs> it's pretty stylish. Um, so I could say, should we go for the decision? Yeah. Yes. <laughs> okay. The, the new school memorized their piece, so the winner is the new school. Yeah. yeah.
playing the violin is so difficult, you know, picking it up and being all relaxed and everything. And I keep thinking that because I play the guitar, so the frets and all, it's a bit confusing. But after when you learn how to let go and relax, I think that is the key to playing the violin. I think it gets a lot easier after the first hour. Yeah, <laughs> yeah. I mean, when I see all of uh, your professional violins, it looks like holding is just a natural. Um, it's the secondary for y'all, but for us, it's like we need to make sure it's correct, and then the notes is a different thing. So it's really much harder than I thought. Thank you very Thank much, you. guys. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you.